Hello. I have a kind of random haul of stuff and just gonna talk and whatever. Oh, I'm so exhausted though, like for real. So last night I started. Oh, my kitty. This is my pickle. She just ran up to me and boops me. I don't know if you could hear on the thing, but she was mewing at me. She's so cute. Um, yesterday I started the 50 milligrams of my Zoloft. I've been on 25 for the last couple weeks. And I was a little, uh, you know, hesitant about going up just because I knew I was going to have more anxiety and more, like, just this exhaustion. Ugh, and I feel it so much. I was shaking like so bad most day. I think it finally settled down a little bit, but like my hands were shaking so bad. I'm just having a lot of like physical anxiety stuff with it and restlessness, but then I'm also feel like so tired. And like I tried to sleep more earlier and I could not sleep. And like, I don't know. I think you can tell like my eyes are dark and I'm not getting enough sleep and it really sucks <laughs> even though I tried but like my anxiety woke me up <sighs> so that's that and it fucking sucks mm. I'm gonna try and take some uh I've been mostly taking like three of the valerian root pills a night then I'm gonna up that because the bottle says you can take five so I'm gonna just take the five that it suggests on the bottle and see if that helps with the shaking and stuff from upping the dose of the Zoloft. Uh, and I gotta, I guess I gotta take a sleep aid when I get off work or before I get off work. Cause I am just like, ugh, my sleep is so messed up. <laughs> but, I uh been running errands the last couple days. So I was gonna show some random things I got. So I had some gift cards to um Barnes and Nobles and I had like fifteen dollars and then I found this uh tortoise pop figure and I I only ended up spending like a dollar something of my own money on this. So I think it was like a buck sixteen for taxes whatever it was but yeah I'm not really sure like what all the little floral stuff is I don't know if it's a reference to like an episode I haven't seen but I just I mean the other sides are normal I just like the TARDIS like and I mean I wasn't I don't know I just wanted to get something and I had $15 in gift cards and that's what I got No, you no fall. Okay. Um. Other random stuff. I went to Menards, which I just got these for my project. It's just a box cutter and blades to cut the baby dolls up with. I got some jelly beans and some whoppers. It's junk food. I don't know. I probably won't eat the jelly beans for a while. It's just like one of those, like they're on sale and I'll probably eat them eventually. So, um, I had another coupon for Victoria's Secret. They weren't completely free underwear, but like they were 54 cents cause I had like a $10 off $10. So I figured I'd just get in our pair of undies. So it's just like a basic pair of underwear. Um, me trying to organize things. Uh, I got this shirt from Rue21. I was actually looking at a shirt very similar to this on AliExpress for like a while, but it was like $7. I was like, I don't really want to spend $7 on a regular shirt that I don't know like what the fabric feels like. And this is like a nice kind of stretchy cotton blend and it was only three bucks and it fits, so. Sometimes when you wait, you'll find something 
you want. And the other thing I got from Rue 21 is just a dollar pair of like sparkly tights. Nothing too fancy. Um, went to Joann's and I got just some elastic. Not fancy. Uh, did I get these from Walgreens? I can't remember. I think I got these from Walgreens. They're just like some like knockoff jelly bellies. And I got some more of the Valerian root because they're buy one get one free. So I was trying to stock up. And I had bought some before too. Because at five capsules a day, it's only going to last 20 days. And I've went to a few Walgreens and they keep running out. And I was wanting to get more, but I don't know. I got four bottles. So hopefully I can find like another sale or just find them online and use like on Amazon or something for cheap too. I just wanted to have a couple months worth. Oh boy. Um, yeah, that's all the stuff that I got. Well, it was mostly random stuff. I also got um, some other Easter leftover candy but that's some in my kitchen. Just like those robin eggs which is basically just a different version. I bought these because I was looking for the robin eggs and the Easter clearance at multiple places and I was like, oh, I guess every place is sold out of them. Bought these and then the next place I went to, there was a bunch of them. And I was like, well, I guess I'll buy the robin eggs too. And I just have this thing of Whoppers for like later. Because I get in a weird mood where I want like that multi whatever it is. I'm not even a big fan of chocolate in general. I just, I don't know. I like the texture and the multi thing. <laughs> I don't know how to describe it. I am way out of it. Oh lord. That's attractive. Um other stuff. I'm working until I guess I'm working for a week and I'll be going to a convention next weekend. So I'll be trying to vlog that. Um probably with my I have some of my friends show up in my vlog. I don't know. <laughs> I'm horrible at planning stuff. I need to like, I, I've been trying to get my friend to come over and do my hair, but that hasn't worked out. So I think I'm just gonna do that tomorrow and just bleach my roots and just deal with it. If I f fuck up again, like I did last time, I'm gonna have to redo all this crap that I did last time. So I'm sure my hair is going to hate me. Um, I did a deep con get deep conditioning on it like, a f mm, what day was that? Was that Thursday? Or was that Wednesday? Wednesday I think it was. I mean I've considered cutting some of this, but I don't know yet. Like it seems like it's doing better than it was. It was just breaking off everywhere and I was getting annoyed, but the deep conditioning seemed to help a little bit. But. <sighs> I think if I'm gonna bleach it myself, I'm gonna try and start with the back of my head and just like work my way forward because it's much easier for me to do this than do all this crap back here. I just like, I don't know how to, it's really hard for me with my hair being so long now to like divide this up and like do these layers right because I have a hard time seeing this and like reaching back here and getting all this crap without making like the biggest freaking mess everywhere and like somehow not getting enough back here where it doesn't actually bleach all the way like it's supposed to like I just got this like weird orangey brown thing going on from the last time that didn't die completely so yeah just frustrating like I need help getting back there but I just like can't get my friend to like get on track with that so it's it is what it is she's got stuff going on so like i can be frustrated but i want to get this done before the convention so i'm just gonna have to take care of it myself like sometimes you just gotta just gotta do what you gotta do i gave her a couple weeks and I've gone back and forth back and forth back and forth and like I've tried to like get her to reschedule and like I can't get her to like reply 
So I don't know what's up with that, but I'm not gonna get on her case about it either. Cause I know she's got her own stuff going on. I try to help her like get a job at my place. We need people and uh, you know, it's, it's frustrating. Like life. Um, I'm still trying to get stuff together for my project for interviews, which is in a few weeks, and I'm gonna finish up one thing tonight when I'm at work, hopefully. I got, I had bought some, a roll of chain too, but that's in my car right now. I was gonna show that in video, but it doesn't even matter. It's just a roll of chain. <laughs> I think I've shown one before that I bought. Um, and then the rest of the little baby arms and legs that I bought in my other thrift hauls, I'm gonna like attach those and it should be enough to finish the skirt part and then all I have to worry about is the, I want to make a crown and um, like a belt and like a bralette type thing. It's all work in progress here. It's just a weird art project slash costume and I am uh, like doing video of my progress as I go along. Though I don't know how cohesive it's going to be, I should probably take video of me actually like working on it, but since I've been doing a lot of it at my job, I just like don't necessarily have like the setup to sit there and like uh, do more than just like record like when I get sections done. And also like I'm wearing like my jobs badges and stuff on my shirt that has the company name and all that so I'm not like <laughs> that's stuff I don't not gonna put on YouTube like I'm not gonna like expose my myself my job or whatever like that's just one of those like it's just better like not to say what company I work for or any of that and I don't want to get in trouble so just some, you just gotta do certain things. Um, trying to think. If there's anything else I want to talk about on this? Uh, you know, I I talked about dating stuff in the other one. It's all progress. You know, he's got a. I don't know. He needs to get on track with his stuff. He's got his schooling stuff, but he's like not taking care of his homework I guess I mean I can't judge too much I was not good in school I couldn't get through school I just had mental breakdowns couldn't balance school and working so I'll give him kudos for trying and doing as much as he can I just it's frustrating like if you want to spend time with someone and like part of their reasoning that they need their time is like to finish homework and then they're playing video games and it's just like you know, at this point you, you can't say anything to me about it like not my fault. Do whatever you gotta do, though. I don't know where I'm going with any of this. I just, this is a very random video, and like, this looks hella junky over here. This is like my camera stuff sitting here, but yeah. I don't know. Um, oh, weight loss stuff. Down another pound. I'm at uh, 186, which I have not seen that number on the scale since like, Mm, end of 2016-ish, somewhere around there. So that's always good. Um, slow progress, very slow progress. It's been kind of stupidly slow, but I also admit, like, just eating kind of crappy for like the last mm, month and a half, something like that. Yeah, month and a half, been eating kind of crappy. Some of that is like you start dating someone again and then if you're over at their place, you're eating with them, and sometimes you're just eating more calories, and like, yeah, he eats a lot. <laughs> I don't, like, I try to stay within a certain calories, but I'm still a little on the high end. But like, part of it too is like, just feeling hungry a lot too, which is frustrating. I don't know, I'm trying to manage it, I'm trying to like, I need to, like get exercise and stuff too which I haven't but like like I mentioned at the beginning with the medicine and everything making me so feel so freaking exhausted like 
I can just barely like get up and do chores and like do basic things right now. So like I'm trying to get my sleep on track first and like get myself on some type of regular schedule and hopefully between that and hopefully like this valerian root if I take more of this stuff and get my sleep right and my body adjusts to the Zoloft that I have some more energy for other shit because I've been dealing with fatigue and stuff for a long time and like just this exhaustion and my sleep's been so fucked just so fucked I just it's really frustrating and I'm just just feeling crappy I just feel really shitty like I want to have energy I don't want to feel like shit I'm just struggling because I want to feel like I can be productive and not be like a complete mess and I don't know I at least be able to like get like 30 minutes or something of exercise a day like that's a kind of a lowish goal but it's something I mean I used to exercise a lot back then I used to ride my bike everywhere there was times I was riding my bike like 17 miles in a day, like something ridiculous. I was like 19, 20 though, so. It's just the depression stuff. It's just convert. Blah, 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 progressively gotten worse over the years, so. And a lot of the fatigue stuff has progressively gotten worse in my sleep and all that. And I don't bounce back as quickly as I used to from having multiple days of bad sleep, which I mean, of course, that's gonna happen when you get in your 30s. I'm 30 and I, I just, I have no bounce back. The last few years I've no, noticed that definitely go away. Like I used to be able to do that shit where I'd be up for like 25 or 24 or 30 hours, sometimes 40 hours. And then like, I would just sleep like 12 hours and I'd be fine, bounce back, cool no issue mm -mm. that's not, that's not a good thing now I can't do all that I just have no no ability and my sleep I always I always think that I don't get very good REM sleep and like I wish I could do a sleep study but I, I don't even have insurance right now like when I did have insurance they wouldn't approve me for a sleep study because they're like well we don't think you have sleep apnea so we don't see a point it's like there could be other things wrong besides sleep apnea like it doesn't have to be sleep apnea but okay I see how it is so Ugh. just frustrating I'll say um yeah I, I think that's gonna be all for this video cuz I'm just kind of like out of it and rambling and we're just spewing bullshit at this point I was just trying to think if there's any other things that I wanted to talk about but we're good um subscribe if you want I post random shit Blech.